I love I love seeing those little little references. <clears throat> yeah, of course, lo lots of Chrono Trigger stuff in there. Yeah. Kind of slow, but I'll take it. Yeah, for sure. Yeah, after the, um, how do I say this without spoiling too much for people that haven't played? Hmm. It's tough. <laughs> But yeah, there there was one particular sequence where I heard a familiar song, and uh, even I teared up a little bit. It was after a very dramatic sequence in the game. You know, I actually didn't get that joke until you just now said it. <laughs> oh, freaking hammers. All right, that's actually pretty well played. This match will get red hot. And I was wondering why they picked four. That is very clever. Oh yeah, isn't there a Dr. Mario tournament or something? Good luck with that, Kyle. Nice. Super skipping, yep. <laughs> Pu Super skip's so comfy, though. Like, the punches first is just so much more comfortable than having to deal with the flies. The fly strats are pretty rough. Can be faster, though. This map will get red hot. You're up! Oh, boy. Gave me the delay. Troll delay. I was a little late there, I think. A little bit on the slower side there, but that's okay.
How does... Okay, so I only know a very little bit about Dr. Mario, and I don't even know if that's accurate. But I understand that there's some, like, RNG control or, like, something, but I don't know how applicable it is. Because I feel like in the Big 20, they had a Dr. Mario part, and I heard something about that. Is it... Is the category for the tournament random, or is it, like, you actually can get the... Like the save RNG every time. <laughs> that big 20 race was amazing for people that didn't get to see this year's. Super close. Uh, lack. Too strong at Zelda 1. <laughs> Made up like two minutes over Prizzy or something in Zelda 1. <laughs> Pretty crazy. Lack attack, yeah. But yeah, like... Top five was basically within like a couple minutes of each other. Uh, SPD Wolf got fifth. Yeah, it popped off because I think he got like 11th or 12th or something like that in the the other Big 20 he participated in in the past. But he got he got fifth on this one, so definitely a pretty big improvement. Yeah, they're so stacked. It's crazy. Oh, I got an extra attack. Now, oh, this is actually kind of fun. okay. I can get a pretty clean ending at least. Yeah, for sure. <laughs> What's crazy about Wolf's run is he was gonna get fifth and he died to Ganon in Zelda 1. Literally last boss of the last game. Um lost like three minutes and still got fifth. <laughs> it was pretty much like the top six were like quite a bit ahead of, of the rest. Like they were all like going crazy. But the other guy um, that was in sixth, um, I think he ended up, like he had a really rough time in Zelda 1. Which, to be fair, I think they were all playing a bit riskier in Zelda 1 because they were trying to get a better, you know, a better placement. Make up some time. Take some risks. Because there's a lot of, like, crazy strats you can do with Zelda 1, like, skipping, uh, the potion and the armor or whatever. Or the bracelet, whatever it's called. Yeah, that's, that is the one weird thing about Big 20 is most of the people that do well in that are all like, they're really experienced with regular Nintendo games already. It is, it is tough as a new player to think about going in there like the only regular nintendo game i've ever ran is contra hey, that's it <laughs> so like if if i were to join one of those for example like i'm learning at least 19 games
Yeah, I ran it for a little bit. Oh my gosh. I did not have the right weapon on there. That is unfortunate. <laughs> Place right into Grand Strap. Oh, thank you, Kyle. I, I had fun with it. It was a pretty fun run. I might I might run it again someday, but I was watching Man The freaking world like The record grind for that game is rough. It's one of those like oh I lost like half a second in the first three levels. Well I guess I reset. Like it's gotten so tight it's Good absurd. Well up. And it's got it's got like you're doing like crazy mashing the whole time. Or at least especially on the base levels. Oh man, that was a bad phase one, but. It just looks brutal. Then again, I guess a lot of the NES games are so optimized that they're pretty rough. If you're going for the top times. But probably a lot of them are just fine if you're just looking to have some fun and learn a new run. Just get the best time that you can. Yeah, Ninja Gaiden, jeez. Everybody that runs Ninja Gaiden has like two billion attempts. <laughs> I feel attacked. You, your Ninja Gaiden time is actually pretty sick, Cooney. That is a hard run. Like, it, it, Ninja Gaiden gave so many people. Ninja Gaiden 1 and 2 gave people a lot of trouble in Big 20. Like, it's just a really tough game. Yeah, I'm sure there's like newer strats now, but that would help out. A brawl is surely brewing. You're up. Oh no, I wanted that. That accidental lobber cost me. Oh my gosh. This Beppy sucks. Apparently no, it wasn't as bad as I thought. Maybe I had a star skip actually on Jimmy or something. 43 what? Dude, that felt like such a bad Beppy. I guess it was just because the the phase one pattern was really quick. So I wasn't able to get a low hanger. I guess yeah, I guess that makes sense. I I had a I had a really hard phase one pattern, but Man, that could have been a crazy time then if I played it better. Oh my gosh. I honestly didn't even see that cloud.
Not bad. Thank you for the good luck. Yeah, I know, Vlover. It was because the phase one was, like, that was honestly, I think, the, the, the best RNG. It's also, like, the hardest, because you get the least time in phase one. Um... So just, just getting the skip on that, like, that's probably one of the hardest patterns to get the skip on at all. But you do get a really fast fight. But that's, that's like, one of those patterns that if I played it really well, I could have gotten, like, a 41 or a 40 on. Which 40 is, like, the, the best that's been done on that fight. And I think it's, it is with that pattern. This match will get red hot. It's on. But yeah, that is it is funny sometimes how like a fight will feel bad and it's still like a good time. And then other times you'll feel like you had an amazing fight and it's like the time's like pretty meh. Yeah, I had a pretty big time loss on both Honey Bottoms and Dr. Cal. The rest of the Owl 3 after that, I remember being very good. Um, but we could actually maybe be in the green if I don't mess up Cal. But this was definitely the weak point of my run was uh, Honey Bottoms and Cal. Good day for a well battle. Now go Okay, so it was a good cow. <laughs> Turns out it was a good cow. We got the time save we wanted. Probably a low 44. All right. Now we're up against a pretty tough aisle three, though, from here. It's gonna be hard not to bleed time. Oh, especially with this RNG. Please transition, please transition, please! It's because she didn't land on my lobber trap earlier. Yeah, this is already a time loss. Okay, that phase was decent, at least. <sighs> okay, actually not bad. I honestly thought I'd lose more here. Fifty-two. Okay, so my my Sally wasn't that amazing, I guess, in my PB. I guess it was just pretty average. Maybe it was the Worman that was really good. I think the Worman might have been like a forty. A great slam and then stop. Here goes. <laughs> Thank <laughs> you. 
Good fight. We got the good RN pretty good RNG too. Not the best, but that's good RNG. Nice, we got another 40. Yo, what's up, Corey? Thanks for the good luck. 40 is, is really good. <sighs> Problem is the, the late game in this is so always so nerve-wracking. Some of the easiest bosses to die on are right at the end. A great slam in that. Ah, uh, not dogs. Okay. Not bad, though. We got gun. Like, dogs is really slow, but gun's, like, the best third attack. So, got kind of a middle-of-the-road pattern. And because of the star skip, I actually saved time. <laughs> Hate dogs in this game. It's a good pace, though. It's a good pace. Still got a lot of hurdles we gotta get over. A great slam and then some. Here goes. Dude, what are these freaking walls? Dude, those are like the most stressful walls I've seen in a while. The spike walls? Normally you don't have to mini plane to dodge them like that. That was a really good phase one though. But I did lose probably a second just to having to be careful around those walls. <laughs> those walls were spooky. All right, here comes the, the, honestly, the scariest fight in the run. This is like choke central. A brawl is surely brewing. It's on. really good. Man, it got scary there at the end. Those flames were actually like very much in my way, but thankfully I had I had the hit point to tank. Pretty spooky ending. I lost a little bit of time on the ending as well, but I'm honestly just happy to be through the fight and in the green. <sighs> Please give me a bonus heart. 
I I do not on this on these kind of nerves want to deal with uh, a three HP fight. Come on, have some have a little bit of mercy, game. Hook me up. One bonus heart's all I'm asking. Two, okay, I'll take it. That's really good. Now we just gotta hope uh, pure, uh, all the like Pirouletta especially cooperates, so we get a good time. Two flames. Okay, that's fine. Two triples. All right, that's really good. so scary when you have to dodge the the lower set point blank like that horrendous thanks for the sub all right here we go please spin Okay, that was still very fast. For charge, that's about as good as it gets. That was really fast for charge. So we're okay. Okay, I'll take it. That was actually ridiculous for charge. Thank you for the gifted sub to manual. 151 with charge, Pirouletta. That's actually ridiculous. All right, here we go. It all comes down to the devil. It all comes down to the devil. Easily the most complex fight in the run. Basically, a 50 50. We need to win. We need the RNG. We need to not choke it. Here we go. Dang it, man. It might be over. <sighs> what a boss. Dang, this was a sick run, too. Oh, I missed that. That's amazing, that miss. Spider world record. It was a complete garbage spider pattern. What a game, dude. What a game. <laughs> Freaking spider, man. <laughs> I could have gotten. I, that was like. That was the 4X, dude. That run was so sick. 